In the introduction to this game, the Dallas Mavericks lost to the New Orleans Pelicans 118. 108 with 33 points from Kyrie Irving and 24 points from Derrick Jones and Tim Hardaway Jr. This team currently sits in seventh place in the Western Conference with 23-17. The Dallas Mavericks are playing very well this season and the most deserving of that is the fantastic Luka Doncic. The Slovenian guard averages 33.6 points and is the second best scorer in the league after Joel Embiid. Despite the fact that Kyrie Irving was thought to be a problem for the Dallas Mavericks, it turned out to be the opposite. So the two complement each other very well. In one part of the season, the X-Factor Dante Exum made a big contribution, but lately the team has been a bit disturbed by injuries, namely Luka Doncic and Dante Exum. Undoubtedly, this team will be stronger after Luka Doncic and Dante Exum come back, which is expected soon. As good as the Dallas Mavericks are offensively, there's a lot of room for improvement on the other side of the court, because this team from Texas is among the weaker teams defensively. If they manage to improve that, they will be able to make an additional step forward. The New Orleans Pelicans beat the Dallas Mavericks 118-108 in the opening game. In a duel in which Jordan Hawkins scored 34 points while Herbert Jones added 15. The New Orleans Pelicans are now sixth in the Western Conference standings with a record of 24-16. The New Orleans Pelicans have been playing superbly since the beginning of the season, and it seems that there is a visible improvement compared to previous years. Brandon Ingram and Zion Williamson are the best players of this team, and they show it game after game. This duo is masterful, and it was known before with the fact that their parts have not been in the service of the team until now. As time went on, they seemed to have found a way to play as a team, which is immediately translated into the New Orleans Pelicans' excellent results this season. And so far, they seem like a very serious competitor to anyone. What this lineup should improve from last season is shooting percentages from the free throw line. If they improved that segment, they would make an additional step forward and be even better. They played three times this season. New Orleans Pelicans won two times. Absences and injuries. Dante Exum, Luka Doncic, and Derek Lively will not be ready for the home team. Zion Williamson, Matt Ryan, Brandon Ingram, CJ McCollum, and Trey Murphy will not be available for the visitors. Considering that they recently played a duel with each other, some things are much easier to predict. The best players of the teams will not be ready for this clash either, which means that the teams will again be depleted offensively. Therefore, we expect that the total number of points in this game will be less than the predicted limit. Our prediction is under 235.5.